cash credit, it's not a problem. She shops every winter, spring, summer, fall, autumn. Whatever the cost, hey everyone, it's me, Monique, and today's video is a little bit different. I've done a DIY before, and it was um, really quick. It was a picture frame do-it-yourself type thing, crafting, but this time, this video is more in-depth, so much so, I am barely behind the lens, my husband is, because he is the one doing it for me, and of course, what we are doing, or what we are giving you the information on, is this vanity right here, which I am absolutely in love with, he did an excellent job, um, some of you may know we are now stationed in Japan, so we live in Japan. Uh, before we left, I had a storage area set up in the room that I was staying in at my parents' house, and I decided to make that the theme of my room here, because since we're here, I have my own girly room. So I have my crafting station, I have my makeup station, I have my office set up, and then I have all my other little cute little girly things that I like to hang up and just look at when I come in in the morning. When we got here, I had already had the bins and stuff that I used from Michael's. So I decided that I wanted to do like a vanity station and I'd already had the desk but I didn't have the actual mirror. The mirror that I had before was really small so I didn't want to use that. So I got on YouTube and I did my research and I saw a whole bunch of really cute vanities. I was even willing to purchase one of them. It was the Hollywood um, vanity glam, you know, mirror that everyone has on their in their videos and stuff. But when I looked at it, I was thinking like, okay, this mirror is about $300, four, roughly $400 or so after shipping or whatever. And it's really small. And if you know me, I can't do small. And I can't do what everybody else is doing. It has to be custom. It has to be different. And I just wanted something else. So I decided I was going to go and take a mirror and get the lights and do it myself. But... Since my husband has worked on houses before, he is able to do the whole electricity thing. He's not an electrician, but he knows what he's doing. He said he can help me. So I got on Pinterest and I found a do-it-yourself type um, article. And the lady that did it, she did a full mirror. Like, I think from the ceiling to the floor is how big the mirror was. And then all the lighting and stuff. And so we used that as a rough idea of how to do it. But we did it a little bit different. Of course, I made the mirror smaller. It's not that much smaller because it is pretty big. But it's not a full length mirror. I love it. It came out amazing. Like, I just, I am so appreciative. I I didn't even expect it to look this good so I hope that you guys enjoy if you stay tuned you'll see the little bit of clips it's not a step-by-step -step, but it's definitely going to give you a rough idea of what you're going to need to do so if you have any questions or you want to know anything about it definitely comment rate and subscribe uh, I had a couple of questions on my Facebook and I had a couple of questions on my Instagram asking me to do a room tour. I'm not too sure when I will do one. Eventually I will, but if you do want a room tour, please subscribe and thumbs up this video. If I get enough subscribers and enough thumbs up, who knows, I might do it. I'm not stingy, I'll share. If you want to see how we did this vanity, stay tuned. Like I said, it has two switches right here. Um, you have an on and an off switch for one set of lighting. This is for the second set of lighting. So it is massive. It is bright. I thought that it would be a lot hotter, but it isn't. Um, but if you have any questions, don't forget to hit me down in the comment box. And I will definitely try to link that information from the first blog that we looked at that gave us the idea so that you can look at that her information was really helpful for us and that is about it you guys have to stay tuned because my website will be back up soon I've been working super hard on it and I can't wait for you guys to see what I have new on my site and I also wanted to thank my husband I appreciate all the work that he put in and the time. He would come straight home from work, sometimes 12, 14, 16 hour shifts, and go straight to working on this vanity. So, 
I, I want to thank him and you guys can say thank you to him in the comments because he wanted to make sure that you had the opportunity if you wanted to make one you were supplied with the perfect information so that you could do it yourself but let me know what you think guys and stay tuned here you go here's uh, how we did this vanity so what is it you're doing right now babe so I did all my measuring uh, to make sure everything's evenly spaced and now I'm just marking wherever I'm going to drill the holes to make it nice and easy for me. So that you can get the wires through? Yes. Uh, yes. So this will be quick and simple once, once I get it all lined up. And it will be easy money. I really appreciate you doing this. I know you do, sweetheart. I love you. I love you too. Cash credit, it's not a problem. She shops every winter, spring, summer, fall, autumn. Whatever the cost, price tags exceed the margin. It's no bargaining when you cop the red bottoms. No shake up on the little on the zone of wear. Underwear, look on it, what she purchases is not fair. Poor stunts like a circus, she lost without a care. Tons rare, other girls in their eyes, you see despair. Yeah. Aware of paparazzi, make it toes not see. Pink champagne, that the way, fill it by sea. I mean, trust me, it's something necessary, like accessories. Red bottoms, like Louis Vuitton with the red bottoms. That's right, like Louis Vuitton with the red bottoms. That's right, like Louis Vuitton with the red bottoms. You gotta have them. Red bottoms, all my East Coast girls. Red bottoms, all my West Coast girls. Red bottoms, all my women across the world. You gotta have them. Red bottoms, red bottoms, red 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 bottoms. Refuse to settle, nothing less than. The levels, runway fashion, a passion, something special. Yeah. Dashing in the ass, then mashing on the pedal. Tea kettle pot, she plot and red bottles. Uh -huh. Top model with physique, I would shake bottle. Scoring with the mons like trying to hit the lotto. Shoes by Jimmy Choo, got money out the Okay, one down, 21 to go. Uh, this one took approximately five minutes or so. It's really no big deal. It's just a matter of routing the hard wires all the way through. Now. Alright, so what I decided to do last minute for Monique was uh, give her an opportunity not only to have a power plug but also a lighting fixture to the point where she can turn on half the lights uh, but also turn on full power if need be. So, so right here I'm going to go ahead and add a plug for her curling iron or something of that nature and then to the right of it I'm going to add the two switches. The, the left half is going to power, you know, every other light. So it will power just like such and then once she turns on the other switch she will have the secondary uh, lighting for the rest of the uh, light bulbs and that's about it. Good job. Okay, so for the wires in the back, what I went ahead and did was not, I routed them all the way through and then I put some hot glue on them to keep them in place so that way when I put the, the mirror in there uh, they won't pop out and also once I uh, put it on the wall it also won't pop out. Uh, so uh, you'll have an opportunity to look at the whole thing once it's done. Good job! I hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully it was very helpful. If you have any questions, comment down below. And I'm just going to say bye-bye.